Greetings gamers! I've been working on a new game called Incoming. Incoming is a 3D VR missile defense game. Protect your cities with a wide assortment of defenses against waves of warheads, bombers, zeppelins, and epic bosses. Wishlist today on Steam. Link is in the description. Greetings, Starfarers. Welcome to another episode of Starfield. I'm Cobalt Thorium, and in this episode, well, in the previous, after the previous episode, I upgrade the ship. So let's go take a look at it, and then we're gonna go and try it out and see what um, we do. Just this business. Dish. I didn't click on you. Go do your thing, friend. Dude, what are you? You just hanging out here in the airlock, waiting for me? What the hell? Whatever, dude. Barrett's such a creeper. Jeez. Alright. So look at this bad boy now. Or bad girl. Ships are always females, right? But, uh, yeah. So I've got new cargo pods here. A lot of it's the same. Or at least the upgrades are in new places. So I got rid of the wings. See, the, um... Yeah, I, I got rid of the wings and I put the uh, these engines here. The ship is, is slower. I'm hoping that this isn't going to be a problem with the turning radius, but these are newer level two uh, engines. So they, even though there's only two of them, there's a lot more uh, thrust to weight. I also gave us a new warp engine, which is this guy right here. And we have some new guns, which look the same as the old ones, but I guess they're faster firing or something like that. So let's check this out. Go to the cockpit. See what's out there. All right, we'll take off. This never gets old. Lift off. Much more normal without those giant engines like out of the wings. Why, we, why do we just now in stable orbit? I don't understand. All right, let's pick up these shipping crates and see what. Oh. Let's see what they are. Plutonium. Why not? We'll take it. I was thinking that what we could do is this is this is a bit of a gamble. I mean, we could go straight into this and see if we could do it. That might be, that might actually be the best thing to do. Or we could go to um, destroy the Crimson Fleet Captain at Kayum. So this is level forty. So that could be difficult. It is within jump distance of us. So Kayum is here. Let's go ahead and try it. It'll be a good test of our new ship. It'll tell us if we need to change anything. Ah! What a ride! Switching grab drive to normal propulsion.
he on the planet? What is going on here? Because I thought the mission was go to any planet in the KM system. Well, we're at a planet in the KM system, right? Confused. Oh, wait a second. Okay, we can jump to him. I think. Yeah, there he is. No, no. The ship, dude. The ship. Yes. Alright, let's do it. Let's see if we can take a level four. We probably can, but it'll be interesting to see. Scan on this place, see what's up. Absolutely nothing. Um, so tungsten, lead, water. Well, we're here, we might as well take a peek. Let's go. Come on, land. thing about wearing these suits is that the more you wear them, the more comfortable they are, the more likely they are to rupture. So the discomfort is a good sign, yes. Not what I want to do. Cancel. Scan. Right, we got our tungsten. Gotta find some water. Plenty of tungsten. We need troop repairs. Those are lots of fun. It's gonna make us go off on some randomly generated mission. It's gonna be boring. Maybe these are like level 40 bad guys. In which case, it's gonna be worth a decent amount of experience if we can kill them. Ship, though. I don't I wonder who makes it. I don't recognize the cockpit. Best 
best thing about low gravity, you can really stretch out, crack the, the back up, relaxing. Oh, well, they got some kind of big lasers here. This guy would blow up. Wow, look at the armaments actually. All right, let's get out of here. Map. Surface map. Return to ship. I wonder if they fixed this fast travel ship. Hello? Nope, they did not fix it. Okay. Well, that gives me pretty good confidence on the the ship front that maybe this ship is actually going to be able to do that mission after all. Let's take off and just see what else is in the system. Ship's good. Welcome, welcome. Let's go. Recalculating. Oh, I forgot to mention that we have a new reactor and too. And orbit stabilizing. Perfect. Let's take a peek at the star map. See what's here. What is this? There's another ship. Um. What is IL? Ionic liquids. Interesting. What is this? Sensor contact. Should I be monkeying around with stuff out here in level 40 land? We are level like 44 now, but I mean, that's not a huge gap. But I want the ship, not the end. possibly go wrong. Black Dreadnought? That sounds very inviting. Ship is now docked. Perfect. Didn't even smell anything. You see corpses. This is not good. We'll have some nice space horror again. Oh, look at this view. Ship's kind of cool looking. place out. Oops. Probably wants, let's see, probably this. Let's drop behind this. Okay, what do we have here? A lot of dead bodies, jeez. Holy cow. Is this six? This looks like a massacre. This looks like an execution here. There's another up. That's a little weird. No. I'm trying to get behind this thing here. It's not open. Okay, that's not open. Very mysterious.
kind of a nice shiny ship. Very polished. Except for the area with all the dead people. It requires a key. Someone can hear us. Bloody Jurgen's slate? Well, they don't need it now. But this person is runny, rummy C, not Bloody Jurgen. Let's take another peek. Let's look here. Credits. Lubricant. Jürgen Slate. Set up. He foreman. Dundas and Curtis were able to scrounge up some guns for the ship. For minor, Curtis has a nose for weapons. Nen Nenadovic has some suggestions on where to hit remote ships. So we're finally underway. Two or three hits should give us a good haul. And then we'll head back. Captain Becker. Going dark. Hey, again, we're in position. Everyone is excited. Ritsky, maybe too much. But it feels really good to be on this side. Hope you'll join us next time. Hate to say it, but mining is for chumps. No offense. Don't know how long we'll have to wait, but we can keep ourselves busy. I'm shutting thing some things down so folks don't give away our position. So you won't hear from us until we're ready to return. Captain Becker. Everyone's pirate names. Okay, so this seems like a bunch of uh, um, miners who decide to switch over to piracy. Everyone's pirate names. Good job on the new names, everyone. Please stop using the real ones, as they aren't scary enough. Rosemary is Rummy C. Ariel is the Asp. Leslie is the Vulture. But she isn't the Vulture. Or uh, Leslie is Vulture, but she isn't the Vulture. Uh, M Milladin is Knife Shadow. Risky and uh, Yuliana are Risky Rover and Firecat. And we're no longer the Dancer in the Darkness either. Bloody Jurgen, Captain of the Black Tread Hunt. <laughs> okay, I like this. This is good. Crew name suggestions. We need to put the fear of God into anyone we attack. As long as folks know we're serious, they should roll right over no one needs to be shot or stranded. We'll leave with the goods. And they'll carry on just fine. Look, we've been raided enough times. This is tough. Knife Shadow had an arm broken and Asp's, and Asp's brother is still in a coma from the raid after that. But they're still here because, uh, because they know we need to be tougher. Give them your best names. Bloody Jurgen Surstrom. Sturstrom, Captain of the Blood, Black Dreadnought, crew names, or crew name, still accepting suggestions for a crew name. The Asp, you're the only one who hasn't given me anything. I need better commitment. Risky Rover, I know you have a shtick, but the group doesn't share it. Love the enthusiasm, but shake up your list and choose a few favorites. The accent is also a bit much. We need to be intimidating. The accent. I don't know what that means. Bloody Jurgen Surstrom, captain of the Black Dreadnought. Like, is that a 
somebody like when they hail people do, do they have an unintimidating like accent or are they talking about like the ship colors like accents that way like I don't know sort of like pink borders on some ship parts or something I don't know small targets I'm bored too but we're new at this and we need to wait for a small target Knife Shadow had a few ideas one will pan out but you're getting uh, Shurstrom of the Fists of Titanium Captain of the Black Dreadnought and Scorch of the Big Dark okay this is pretty funny uh, R.L. Constantine is a hypocrite and a killer Miladin went in shooting he wasn't supposed to but we're pirates Risky shouldn't have been so shocked afterward they should have either been ready for this wait they, they should have been ready for this Arl said he didn't want to kill people either uh, it didn't stop him when the argument got heated and the captain pulled the gun Becker went down and everyone started shooting Arl didn't realize I wasn't dead when he gathered up all the slates and wiped them missed this one and the captain's to boot and, and wait missed this one in the captain's boot just as he missed my breathing he tried to remove all the evidence and flee the ship we hit and flee in the ship we hit but I'm letting you know so he can't come home don't let him pretend he isn't a killer too So the captain pulled the first gun, huh? So Arl, it seems like, at least got out of it. Maybe that's who's locked in the front room there. Alright, one of these guys probably the key crew member. Oh, they don't have their, their fancy names. That's unfortunate. Oh, that's the captain. So, no key. Might have to inspect a little bit closer here. Maybe we have to get the key elsewhere. I don't know. more corpses. We didn't come over here before. I guess we didn't. My complete list. All attempts. Locked compartment key. Here we go. journals in a second here. No data, no data, no data. We'll grab this. I wonder if these actually have no data. Data unavailable. Format slate to edit. Okay, let's try one more. Okay. I think we're just going to assume that they all have no data. What is this? Notebook. Alright.
who is hearing us if it's not somebody out here? Ooh, a little bit. Let's take that. Out. This is a, a shortened. Yeah, this is just what we, we were reading before, but it's shortened. Actually, no, it's not. Some of it is. Hey, Foreman, Dundas and Curtis, uh, and Curtis uh, were able to scrounge up some guns from the ship. For minor, Curtis has a nose for weapons. Nia Dovic has some suggestions of where to hit remote ships. So we're finally underway. Uh, Two or three winds should give us a good haul, and we'll head back. So we've read that one before. So this is to Fern Fernande Laval from Herman Becker. This one here is, looks different. I'm glad the crew is finally coming together. It was a tough ask, but I think you chose the right people. Juliana Rissou is a good friend and has never let me down. Thank you for taking her husband Risky on as well. I know he can be a, a lot... Cr uh, a lot in cramped quarters, but he's a hard worker. I don't think Ar Arl would volunteer, but he knows how desperate we are, and he's always ready to help. You know we're struggling here, and I know you won't let us down. So that's Foreman Laval, who's who this initial one was to. And this one we've read before. So who can hear us? That is my big question. Oh, there's a couple of safes here. I'll try to do this quickly. All right. Looks like a good bet. not good for anything. That's going to consume one of our ones. I think we probably need to save the ones. Too like that. Yeah, I guess it has to be this. If one works at all, it's gotta be that one. Suspense is killing me. Very straightforward. 
to make sure we haven't missed anything else here. But I'm very curious as to who hears us. Monkey and around down here. There's this area. There's this area. There's no real. Oh, I thought I missed that. Okay, let's be a little bit more thorough here. New things didn't go as planned, but we survived and got what we came for. Get packed up. Vulture, please lock up when you're done. Oh, these ones actually have the names. So they must have shot these people? I don't know, I'm confused. Because these ones have the proper names. Knife Shadow, Fire Cat. Risky Rover. Vulture. listening to us maybe it's maybe it, it the sound thing fluctuates even if there's nobody here it's a little weird I suppose the answer is the the old question like if a tree falls in the forest and the ways that are here and I guess it does make a sound if somebody's invading your ship and the, but there's nobody here to hear it and um, you know they still hear the footsteps all right let's try let's just read some of these all attempts all attempts angry alligators bloodied balucan crazy cassowaries i have no, no idea what that is dread deals evil eels feral foxes grizzly gaur horrible hairy mao Im immortal ibis Jealous Jackdaw, Killer Komodo, Lucky Leopards, Mighty Muntjack, Nauseous or Noxious Nyala, Outrageous Orangs, I guess it's like an orangutan maybe, uh, Pestilent Piranha, Quaking Quagga, Rapacious Raja Lout, jeez, these are terrible, Scrappy. Saula, Terrible Tentoran, Uncanny Ular, Voracious Vine Garoon, Wild Wolves, Sharp Zolo, Yowling Yaks, Z uh, Zealous Zarafa. Okay. Oh, I suppose that's kind of funny. Better suggestions than Risky. Better suggestions than Risky Rovers. Muck Knockers, Giants of Industry. Financial Ruin, Can Openers, Crushers, Boring Batch, that's a pretty good name. I kind of like the uh, Financial Ruin and Can Openers. Uh, Drillage and Steel, Broken Jaw, and Blast Caps. Blast Caps is pretty good too, especially if they're 
since they're miners. Captain Becker's uh, external comms. Okay, I think we read this one. Yes. There's the coachman. There's a key. Grendel, complete list. My complete list, Terror in the Darkness. That's pretty good. Fist of Iron. Is that the one that they end up going with? I, I don't remember. So no data. Okay, the no datas are legitimately no data. Storage unlocked. Okay. It seems like that's it for messages. Well, it's a little bit uneventful. Um, I might wrap it up here. I feel like there's probably too little time remaining to really do like a full quest or anything. So we'll just return to the ship and I don't know. We'll wrap it up here, I guess. But uh, yeah, thank you very much for joining me. I hope that you enjoyed this. And if you have, please like, maybe comment, maybe share, maybe subscribe. New episodes every day. At 4 p.m. Glad to see you're back in one piece. U.S. and Canada. I'm Cobalt Thorium, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.